The subject is book covers, Himalayan book covers. And book covers are carved wooden blocks, rectangular in shape, and often gilded and painted. And they serve as, as the protective covers for the stacks of loose leaf pages of uh, Tibetan, Sanskrit, or Nepalese uh, uh, books. The, the covers can be generally divided into four main subjects based on design. The four are decorative, figurative, lanza script, and red ground. Now, the decorative covers are primarily design, uh, different designs, uh, geometric designs, also with uh, animal elements and motifs and a lot, of, uh, a lot of vine work and vine scrolling. The figurative covers are where you have the Buddhas, Bodhisattvas, uh, different types of, of uh, religious figures, either Buddhist, uh, Hindu, or Bun religion. Often these can be, these are either carved uh, on the front, carved on the back, or they can be painted. And, and if they're painted, it also can be the front or the, or the, when I say back, I mean the inside of the, bo of the book cover once the book cover is lifted and turned over. Um, the third type is the Lanza script, or sometimes Ranjana. And this is a, a decorative Nepalese uh, written script that is used often for religious books to, to decorate, to, it's very stylized. Uh, and often, even in Tibetan language, when you have the Lanza script, uh, it, it is in Sanskrit. The, the actual reading of it, the, the letters are, are, the words are Sanskrit, not Tibetan. The fourth type is red ground, and red ground is coming basically from China, and it is uh, really, it is a red lacquer, and uh, a very decorative and used for large collections of books, uh, large, uh, uh, B the Buddhist collections. Uh, very decorative, very ornate. So this is basically coming from the Yunglo period, so it's early 15th century, and it's also done in the, uh, very much so in the uh, Chenlong period of the 18th century in, in China. So these are the four main, main types based on design. Uh, probably the most interesting are the, are the decorative, because they kind of transcend time with with the beauty of the geometric shapes and design work you it's really hard to date them because they some of them seem so modern in in style uh, another interesting type in the in the figurative uh, is the and the decorative a little bit is the bun uh, book covers because the the carvings that are done are just so unique and not something we're used to. So the Bun book covers are very fascinating as to uh, what they mean and, and what the symbols represent. So that's the four types of book covers.